First time ever that BYU has been in this spot after joining the conference this season. Over on that right side on uneven bars, such a smooth bar swinger. Excellent bail to handstand. You saw those legs glued together, arms stick straight. And she just has to dismount. I saw her stick this in warm up. Let's see if she can stick it here. Yes, she and, can. Yes, she can. And on the right side on bars, Kylie Equinto finishes up, following up Jorgensen's 9825. job with this beam routine four inches wide the balance beam when you put it on podium it can be a little tricky and over on the right with Lindsay here's in the anchor for BYU on bars right side of your screen Anna Bradley we're counting nothing below 9825 BYU this is a great event for them Anna looked amazing in warm-ups this is the double layout wow College stick, which the judges really want to see those athletes hold their landings. This is Madison Raisley Patton on beam for BYU. Well, it's going to be a good score for Allred. We know that coming in. Madison showcasing dynamic series there. That was a handspring layout step out. Coming after Alex Mason's 9.625. That is going to be the score that BYU is looking to drop. Madison on the left, just the dismount. Yeah! It sticks the one and a half twist. Way to get this BYU team back on track on balance. Beam. And coming up next for West Virginia on floor. Amber Lowe, Lauren, she's had to deal with a little bit of a challenging situation before she got to Morgantown, wasn't she? Yeah, and she really has had to learn to fall back in love with the sport again. She questioned so many things, and finally the coaches were able to really earn her trust, reminding her that she doesn't have to be perfect, and they're there to help pick her up when she's down and when things get rocky. And now you can just see that confidence radiating within her as she gets ready to close out her freshman season at West Virginia. And here is Amber on the right side of your screen for the match. She does so well as comes in on her gymnastics and really takes that individualized, this is me approach. Her mom an Olympian for Bulgaria. Her dad was the coach in that team in 1992. But we're going to see Hutchinson in the all-around. Three more opportunities to witness her greatness, the two-time defending Big 12 gymnast of the year. Elise Rollins. I'm sorry, Millard Crossman finishing up her beam routine. For Denver, but Elise Rollins. She smiles throughout this entire beam routine. <laughs> and that's another stuck dismount. Alex, right now, balance beam is a great event for BYU, but it seems like tonight they're making it their best event. 49-5 NQS by the numbers, actually. It's Denver's best event, fifth in the country. All right, here's Anderson. Following up Rollins 9 9. This might be the routine of the meet for BYU. Slight balance check there. Just so you saw those arms through that full circle. That is just a minor deduction. But Brindley, a freshman in this anchor position. What an outstanding position and the confidence that she must feel in herself and her team. And there's UI in the anchor spot for Denver on bars.
Very nice start. They had a lights out beam rotation. Olivia, round up one and a half front layout. Sydney Benson getting set, following up Schoolies 985. Nine nine seven five the score for Davis, which it seems to be either it's that score or a ten, and it's usually a nine nine seven five the thirteen for her. Imagine thirteen runner up and one win. You could think of it that way almost, getting that 10. She did get her first though, and I would imagine there could be one coming in regionals as well. Well, Sydney Benson on the right side of your screen for BYU, doing a really nice job. Coming after Heidi Schulley, 9.85. They're really breaking in. Sophie, Sophie broke into the 9.9s. BYU showing that they are not done yet with this Big 12 competition. BYU on a roll right now. Green to close out the rotation, Kylie E. Quinto. They're dropping a 9-8 at the moment. 49-7-2-5 on bars for Oklahoma. Tying the NCAA and Big 12 bars record. They already set the vault record. Well, if you set one record, you might as well set a couple more, but over on floor right now, Right now, BYU has a 49-225, a very respectable score for BYU. They are looking to drop that 9.8 from Olivia. She was in the second spot. Final pass for Kylie, round off one and a half from layout. 
eight, no problem. Floor with a look to make their mark and stay with Oklahoma. Alex Mason leads off for BYU. And that was a Yurchenko full nice start for BYU again. So you get into that rhythm and they just do it every weekend. Sophie Dudley for BYU. Off of the 9-9. Cindy Benson for BYU, and that follows up about 775 for Jordan, so we're going to drop that at 5. Big ball here for Kylie, your pick up pull. Could not have done it any better. The execution, the lay. 